All right, y'all, this is part two of the testing at Westgate Town Center. We tested T-Mobile. Uh, let's go ahead and test Verizon here, and we're gonna do AT&T after this video too. I'll put links to all the videos here within the description box of this video. All right, so again, Rocky River, Fairview Park, Ohio. Uh, this is the Verizon store right there in front of me. Same setting as before. I'm actually in the same spot. This is just like discontinuous videos. You'll see the, the line there for Chick-fil-A up the yin yang we got uh, Longhorn, Walgreens, lots of shopping. There's apartments, there's all types of stuff. Anyways, the carrier's got a lot of a lot of traffic to deal with here. So um, what we're gonna do is we're gonna test Verizon now. As I tested T-Mobile previously, we'll see how Verizon holds up. We'll test the LT and, and we'll test the 5G. I don't know if they have DSS, I don't know if they have millimeter wave, I don't know anything. So I'm just kind of blindly testing the networks and assessing how they're doing over here. Okay, so for Verizon, wow, look at that uplink. Uh, we have 28 millisecond ping. We've got a little bit of jitter at six milliseconds, 75 megabits down. And you guys saw the uplink was cooking there for a second. We got 70 megabits per second on the uplink. That's really good stuff there from Verizon, holding up just fine. Uh, the signal strength is high, so I'm assuming that the site is pretty close. I think it's a rooftop site that's actually on the other side of the street there. So we're holding up pretty good. That is very nice. Uh, no issues there in LTE. I'll switch it over to 5G and see if we got any DSS or possibly ultra wideband that I don't see. We'll go ahead and test it out here and, and see what we get. All right, so let's boot it into 5G on, on the iPhone. And it looks like we do have 5G. Regular 5G, meaning it's the nationwide stuff. That would be DSS, dynamic spectrum sharing. Uh, around here, we do have N5, so that would be low band 5G. I don't know. Let's see what we get here. Let's see if it's any good. Windstream, Cleveland, Ohio. Okay, so we got a nearby server. Sorry for the wind noise, by the way. It's a windy day. It was storming earlier in the morning. So this is N5. I don't think they do N2 out here, N66 or anything. Mm. All right, 51 millisecond ping, 160 millisecond jitter. What is going on there? 96 on the down and 51 on the up. So fast, nice, very good. Uh, download faster than the LTE, upload faster on the LTE. So a little bit of different performance there. Things look pretty good here. Verizon holding up, T-Mobile holding up thus far. The last phase of testing I'm gonna do is AT&T. You guys will be seeing that on the next video. So thanks for watching and make sure that you do comment and uh, let me know what you guys think of the testing. Uh, Freaking Chick-fil-A. You, you think they, they were giving away money or something, seriously. Anyways, drop me a line. Let me know what you think of the testing, how Big Red held up and what do you think of it. And, Thanks for watching. Share this, like it, comment, all the great things. Uh, subscribe for more content from the SMT. Thanks for watching. See you on the next one. Peace. Thank you for taking this opportunity to watch the SMT YouTube channel. If you appreciated this video, give it a like and a share to all your favorite social media platforms. Thank you in advance for that. Also, check out some of the links in the description box. We have the SMT Patreon page. We also have the Twitter handle at Sneed Tech. And do check out the audio-only podcast available on all the major podcast platforms. And if you are new and have not subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and activate the bell notification icon so you never miss an upload from the SMT. We'll catch you on the next video. Peace.